Okay, everybody, Jen from Scrapping Posh. This is my artistic studio creation design team project using the Prima Marketing Collection from Moonchild. And we are going to decorate the front and then we're going to add a dangle charm thing. Uh, I have my Wheel Memory Keepers eyelets from ASC Supplies, but I think, <clears throat> if I'm not mistaken, the last time I looked, she was out. So, I think I only need one of those. So, and we want it right pretty much on the edge because we're only giving, we only have this little bit. To hang over, or you can put two and sandwich it between. So I'm going to use the small size hole and make sure it's somewhat in the middle. Two, three, four, five, six. So does that mean this is the middle? say that was the middle. Is that the middle? One, two, three, four, five. This is the middle. Okay. I have no idea where that's hitting. I should turn it this way. There we go. All right. That's much better. Poked a little hole. Put the eyelet in the little hole. I think the hole's too small. I think I should have used the bigger hole. Yes, I should have. I, I, there's actually directions on how to do this, but God forbid I read the directions. There we go. Now I have a hole. And this fits in it, which is nice. And then I think these are 3 sixteenths. And I already got it set for that. And they smash. So nice. The We Are Memory Keepers brads or eyelets are the absolute best when it comes to setting. Okay, make sure I have the front cover. Now my little glue's beating up. I'm thinking that I should probably get um, some E6000 for these guys though. Let's do that. I buy these little ones now. Because I had a couple of the big ones dry out on me. Okay. That pen will never be the same. Make sure it's flat.
These are very thin pieces of metal. And I can't tell you where I got them actually. Okay. I'm going to put some on the bigger spots and try not to get goop all over the place. On the edges. And on this back corner. works. I have I have like the bulldog clips but they're kind of buried so okay and again I don't know what to use on the flowers. Should I try the E6000 on the flowers? Is it better than hot glue? These things I don't know. I'm going to read the E6000 and see if it says. I think we'll just do the front for now. I have a couple for the back too, but I don't want to there we go. That looks good. Okay, put the lid on this for now. Okay, so I'm having problems keeping this thing in screen here. It's just large, so I'm going to add, I think I want, where should I put my cluster? Like, do I want it coming? This really isn't, so I could do that. Yeah, I like it. Let's do that. This bling came from Prima Marketing, actually, but it's probably a good five years old, at least. With some of that uh, say it in crystals, I think. I have another one sitting right here next to me, that's why I know what it is. It's in the packaging. Okay, so for these, you just kind of lay them down the way you want them without pushing, and then you can kind of move them. Until something gets stuck. That looks good. Okay, so there's that. And I have these flowers, but let's put some big flowers on first. So these are from um, Artistic Studio Creations. They're the mulberry paper flowers. And then I have some flowers that I had before too. Okay, here we go. Uh, and then these little green guys on the back, if I don't stab myself first, 
you can just take and wrap around something like paintbrush, uh, handle or something. Just make some little loop-de-loops and then you'll just have a little And I, I ain't scared. I'm going to start committing. We're going to start gluing this stuff down. I'm using hot glue on the flowers. Okay. I think I had that one somewhere around in there. I pushed down a little bit. Uh, I'll probably only put one more big one on there. Don't need that ugly glue string hanging. Some dark purple and peach. We'll put probably two each, maybe three. Just see how it looks. And then my I found these in my stash. These I think they're the same brand, but they're three mil, five millimeter. So I got two of those, two of those, and then I like a lot of these little ones because they're super cute. And then I have a big, like, um, is it acrylic? So let's put our paper ones in and see where we are. to go check on my dogs here. Okay, I'm debating on whether or not to stick this cameo on there. Kind of reminds me of that girl. Or I can just put it on the, the, the dangle. Let's think about that. I think the dangle. I think I'm going to put on the dangle.
Okay. Okay, I think that's it for those flowers. Okay, so let's add some of these little blingy things here because I think they're awesome. Or should we add... No, I like these. I was thinking we should add the Graphic 45 matte, matte ones, but I like these. You have to make sure that they're making contact with the, uh, the paper. I like to tuck, tuck them under, like the flowers. I think that's my king. There we go. Just a little dab of hot glue behind there. We got the hot glue on the leaf. I don't think it's touching anything. Okay, I think we need some stickles to liven up our flowers a little bit. So um, I'm just going to put dabs on as kind of like water droplets. But shiny ones. some of the hot glue gunk. I think I'm done with my hot glue gun. I'm gonna unplug it. Okay, and I know Crystal's just got a huge shipment of all different colors of stickles. Some I don't even have, I think. I'm just putting little droplets on here. It looks really nice on the darker colors.
And I think that looks pretty nice. There we go. And then if you had anything like a title or a name or something, or maybe even a nice uh, picture, like you could put it here, put some acetate and it's kind of framed for you. So like this was one of my daughter's senior pictures. So you see if you put that there, you kind of frame it with maybe some more gems, put a piece of acetate over it so the picture doesn't get ruined. So, or, you know, a name or a title or something like that. And a silver would be nice. But I think, I think we're pretty much done with the cover. That was easy. I'll just add a couple more of these little blings here. Just I, I like tucking them under. Oops. Flipped over on me. Okay, and then um, we're gonna let that dry because of the stickles that are on there, and then we'll put the corners on the back side. 